Hey, Tony, thank you so much for your time earlier. It really was great to meet you and I could talk to you for hours, clearly. So I am sorry that I had to run, um, but I did want to shoot you this short video to answer some questions that you had in your follow-up email and discuss a few other things. So first things first, we don't have a minimum spend requirement for advertising. Uh, we base the campaigns on what your growth goals are. Um, now you'll see in our agreement that it does recommend that we get to about $4,000 a month in advertising spend, but that is not required. What we'll do is we look at the current campaigns that you have actively running, because I know you are doing some PPC. So anytime we take over for a seller who has active campaigns on Amazon, you don't want to stop what you're doing because that'll stop sales. Uh, so within the first 72 hours of our working your account, we do a full audit on all of your open campaigns that you have, whether you're doing display or PPC, uh, we want to make sure that those are optimized. So with your PPC, we're going to negate any keywords that aren't converting. And then if you're doing display advertising, and we recommend all types of advertising on Amazon because it does work. I'll talk more about that in a minute. But if you are doing display advertising like banner advertising, we're going to do look at the click through rate on those, make sure that it's optimized. If we need to do some A-B testing on that, we will. Um, but once we've done a full audit on your campaigns and we've negated any waste that you have, then we work those campaigns moving forward. And we recommend that as sales grow, that you start investing or reinvesting some of that money back into advertising. Here is why advertising is important for you and for Pinky Bear specifically. Remember your organics, you only have 288 organic keywords. Again, those should be in the thousands. The way your organic keywords grow is by getting traffic to your listing. Right now, the only traffic that's coming to your listing is through advertising, right? So we've got to use that advertising in tandem with our SEO process so that we can grow your organics and then improve the ranking on your organics. So um, again, back with advertising before I move on to our SEO process. Advertising, we don't have a minimum spend. We do report on this on a weekly basis and everything that we do, especially when we first start with you is with your approval, right? So we're going to review all of this with you and very granular with the reporting that we do, bid adjustments, keyword changes. I'll be report all of this. Ideally, we like to see your tacos. If you've measured those tacos, 8% conservatively on the high end, 11 to 14%. Um, but we're very good stewards with your money. Our philosophy on advertising, spread liberally, but bid conservatively. You don't have to have the highest bid to win conversion every time. You've got to be optimized. Now, in tandem with your advertising, we do recommend our SEO process. So um, I sent the SEO four phases to you in the email um, but this is also something that we're going to do for you. You need to do this. Otherwise, you will always pay for placement on Amazon. We love to prove Amazon wrong and use those tools that sellers have, i.e. organic keywords, that are free to you so that you can get that traffic to your listing. It's going to give you long-term growth on Amazon. And what's great about that is when you start to add new products, there's variations and parentages and a lot of things that we can do to help uh, increase your organic keywords, to increase your reviews. All of that merchandising is also part of the conversation and within the scope of work. So uh, pages three, the, the, actually the last few pages of the electronic proposal or agreement show the full scope of work. So Tony, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out. You are a pleasure and I can't wait to start working with Pinky Bear. Thanks so much. Hope you have a great day. Talk soon.